What's good everybody? It's me, Ollie, aka TNS Satitude, and I'm back here on YouTube.com. And today, well guys, you're getting a double video from me this week. You got the food review on uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, and today we are doing a uh, re reports coming in on a report video of YouTube megastar Logan Paul has signed with WWE. And you know what? I actually think this is a pretty uh, interesting signing. I'm not going to lie. You know, when you look at how WWE and AEW both are run, you know, AEW is the professional wrestling company and WWE is sports entertainment with that bit of wrestling in there. You know, I definitely think Logan Paul is someone who, I mean, look at this guy. I mean, look at his following. If you put him in there, I think there is definitely some potential for someone who, if he's willing to learn, which of course he is, uh, this could be a very successful signing. Um, you know, am I expecting him to be Kurt Angle? No, but am I expecting him to be very entertaining? Absolutely. And the program going in with, of course, him and The Miz for SummerSlam, I think is a interesting thing. You know, they've got a story wrote there already from obviously uh, WrestleMania 38 where Logan had a fairly good showing, you know, seeing him live, you know, I, I was very impressed, you know, huge production value for him, and of course, coming out with the Charizard card, you know, this guy is just like, very, very, you know, he's got that appeal, there's no doubt about it, and I, I'm, I'm interested to see where they do go with him, you know, is he going to just be around for big budget matches, like the big premium events, like your SummerSlams, your WrestleManias, or... You know, I'm hopeful he's going to just, you know, they'll slot him in and he'll have uh, some decent programs going forward, you know. And I think The Miz is definitely a, a good start as a reality TV star that The Miz was coming in and learning the business and going again, you know, him now being the veteran and, and, you know, going with somebody like Logan Paul. We'll see what happens, you know. Um, I know this kind of signing is probably not everybody's cup of tea. <clears throat> But when you look, and I did say this on my Facebook, like they they've signed the the likes of Ronda Rousey in the past, and you know she's had huge, you know she's got a huge following. And when you got AEW signing the likes of Paige Van Zant, it's like you know I don't I don't think there's a limit on who they can bring in if they want to learn the business and learn the art of professional wrestling then, you know, you can't judge it. I just think it's going to be somebody else who can bring this uh, this art out there. And, you know, Logan Paul definitely will fit into the WWE way of doing things. So I'm, I'm very much interested to see where this goes. And, you know, at the end of the day, the WWE to AEW is like, you know, it's the Pepsi to the, the Coca-Cola, you know, they're two different brands completely. And that's all it is and you know let's just see where this goes and not only that with like i've said before you know wwe's roster is has been thin it's, it's a thin roster so it's definitely somebody else that you can have on the main roster that's gonna you know fit in there into some you know to help you know push some programming going forward so definitely interested to see where they go with this but guys, that's my thoughts. Let me know what you think of Logan Paul signing with WWE today. Breaking news. And uh, guys, I'll see you soon for another one. Take care, everybody.